<laughs> All right, okay, we're back again. One more time, one more time. Thank Can you, you for coming here? back. Okay, invite your followers. We gotta get everybody back in here. Lost volume. We gotta get everybody back in, cause I'm I'm gonna finish the cake soon. Listen, I can't stand my voice. Oh, right. Okay. I can't help it. I talk. I don't think All right. Okay. I don't. I feel like I my voice is annoying, and I talk really fast when I get nervous. You're good. You're good. And they're coming back. Okay. All right. Thank you guys so much for for continuing to follow. I know that you could have been gone somewhere else but thank you for coming back to us yes please invite your followers I'll please i want to make yeah share with everybody i really want everybody to see the finished product and the finished cake who got the volume up on theirs okay i'm gonna show you one. okay okay there we go loves uh here we go love sweets is the facebook your account okay and uh this is uh yes ma'am on sweets on ig and she's at www.yesmam.us for classes and sculptures and things like that. So check her out. She is excellent. She did the dragon, the mermaid, unicorn. Okay. Unicorn. She's awesome with that modeling chocolate fondant and all that stuff. So if you want to learn those structures and things like that, she is one to follow. All right. So before we got cut off and nobody could hear what I was saying, I was explaining. What's the um, the new version of frosting? A, not new, a newbie version of frosting a cake. <laughs> <laughs> so what the newbie version is is sometimes people use piping bags to fill up the middle part and smooth it out so they can get a nice even layer of frosting. Um, but if you've done this for a long time, you can kind of eyeball how much frosting you need in the middle. Um, also, when people frost the outside of the cake, they use another piping bag to like pipe all around to get a nice even layer and then you just use your smoother or your offset spatula to smooth it okay Go that's ahead. my daughter marissa kamisha vanna oh i'm like this is our vanna oh, oh. <laughs> you want to see your face <laughs> okay. well kamisha was like who's that I know. who's the one holding <laughs> the board <laughs> she said hey marissa hey oh, wait, all right, so what I'm doing now is I'm just evenly cleaning oh, up the what edges. What photos do we have on Facebook um, for the Love Suite? It's a, a dessert table, right? It's a dessert table. You can't find it on your phone. That's another thing. You have to use like an iPad or, or a tablet of some sort or your um, computer or your laptop. People have tried on their phone. You can't find it with your phone. Why? I know. I don't know. Uh, um, Dre says look under uh, groups. Are we going to do upside down method? Um. <laughs> no, no. Upside down method to even your to even your edges. Big Mama Queen, we're um, they're trying to find our group Love Sweets. Um, it's a Facebook group where we're all in and we uh, share uh, different things. We come together. We have meetups and just ha have a good time enjoying each other um, as friends as well as bakers who can just get together and talk about you know baking and and, and techniques and going to the conventions and yeah so, um skills night is all about sharing so us here in georgia um there's not many people here that have classes and we formed our own classes and formed our own group to share with you guys so if you like our skills night share with your followers show us some love tell people about it tune in it's um twice a month it's not going to always fall on a sunday but it's twice a month we'll be announcing in all these groups when skills night is so you guys know what we're going to do and you guys can see what we're doing next skills night we're doing cotton candy. Um, I have a cotton candy machine. We'll be making cotton candy right in front of you. So it may work out. It may not. Who knows? Yeah, but yeah. Honey wants to know what flavor the cake is. It is yellow cake from... What's this box cake called? It's a box cake. It's a yellow cake. Somebody wants to know the name again. All right. I think it was Betty Crocker. It was a yellow cake. It was a dollar nine at Walmart. The frosting is Wilton, um, the Wilton tub buttercream frosting. You can find at Walmart, or you can also find at Michaels in the Wilton aisles. The um, candy, I got all the candy from Party City. Look at all these candies. So candies. Nice. Paw Patrol cake. No. And then I have Pop Rocks. Pop Rocks. All these Pop Rocks here. And then I have all these different sprinkles that I've gotten and I've collected. These are all different sprinkles and drachés that we're going to use on the cake. You move too much. Sorry, I'm yeah. trying to make <laughs> camera woman. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little fast. Sorry. 
Um, so yes. Candy. Yum. Yeah, all this candy. So now that I've gotten the majority of the cake done, look, I could spend all night on making sure this thing is nice and even, but we ain't got all that type of time. So I'm just getting this part down here. Now for the sake, because this is a drip cake, you don't have to do the upside down method to get your edges so perfect. Drip cake covers all of that up for you, okay? Um, but if you want to, you're more than welcome to, but you'll just be wasting time because it's nothing that nobody's gonna see. Wilton buttercream, she put her mask on her mouth. <laughs> well, this, for this, um, some people love Wilton buttercream. Yeah, you don't you have know? to like it, I mean, some people like it, and if they like it, I love it. Shoot, that's <laughs> fine. You know, um, some people use um, Wilton fondant. Some people use satin fondant. Some people use Element fondant. It's it just depends on you know what's good. Sometimes customers like things to taste like your Publix cake. Sometimes customers don't even know what box um, what real cake tastes like right. when you make it from scratch. You know what I mean? So it just depends on your customer. So for for the sake of this demo, we're using all box stuff. Especially because when you're new, you don't know recipes. Um, you don't know how to incorporate what you want to do into your cake designs and stuff like that. So for the sake of this, we're going to use all box stuff and make it easy for everyone. Yeah. All right, so now we're going to drip it. So where's my chocolate girl? Look, I ain't got my chocolate girl here. You just said, don't explain to Drea. We had to explain. Oh, that was Drea? <laughs> Drea, be quiet, girl. You had me explain it thinking you were but someone else. our other people needed to know, so you yeah, know, that was a good thing for everybody else. <laughs> Listen, I'll be paying no mind and no Drea. <laughs> okay, my chocolate girl. Can I steal girl. one? I'm stealing one. No, you can't steal one of the lollipop. Oh, you can I, steal one of the small lollipop. Yeah, I want a little one. Ooh, oh, you oh, got I'm my candy in here anyway. Oh, I probably do. And, and Lala had a good time opening them all up too because these are mine. Y'all remember these as a kid? Girl, I don't remember these candies. <laughs> the big bowl. Huh. I think that's how you say it. So what we're doing for your drip, you want to make sure you get one of these. Chocolate. This is chocolate. You want to get one of these. You can find these at Walmart. You can find these at Michael's. I got mine from Walmart because it's cheaper. Um, these little two ketchup bottles. Right? And I cut mine to be a big hole cool. so that my chocolate can come out more. Hey, Kamisha. Now, let me tell you something. I haven't done a drip cake in like a while. So let's hope this comes out right. Maybe we should get a, big, a bigger one. Thanks for the hearts. Thanks for the hearts. <laughs> these pretty colors candy pop rocks. oh somebody can ask what the flavor of the cake is oh and yeah it said it looks pistachio ish Ooh. oh oh yeah. because the icing the icing is just regular um white buttercream um wilton and i just colored it with neon um green and teal colors um yeah it's no it's no flavor we just got basic basic flavor and the chocolate somebody asked was um almond bark yeah chocolate is almond bark would you buy the almond bark? Wally World. Walmart, you get the um, almond bark. That's good. And we colored it with CK Neon Pink. Bam. Yeah. Right there. I'm going to need more to put on the top. Okay. Okay, so what you want to do first when you do your drip cake is you want to do the sides to drip it. This is my boy's cake. The size to drip it. Let me see. Maybe that might be. It's a real cake. Okay. This might be enough. Yes. All right, guys. Um, there I go. This one. Uh, this. Oh. Oh. This one is a. Not an oil base. This is just a gel. Don't do it. Oh, don't use that in the but chocolate. <laughs> in the chocolate, um, don't use gel because what happens it'll seize up your chocolate yeah. you want to use oil color what she was showing you is something you use have to the oil <laughs> use, this, right. use this one it's oil based um food coloring and that's what you use in the in the oil chocolate candy color yeah so okay a little neat trick Sorry. i know so when you use this right this is what you use to make your drips 
Yes, you can airbrush color on a buttercream. Yeah, yeah, you can do that too if that's what you want. But I'm gonna tell you right now, if you airbrush and drip, your chocolate might take off your airbrush color. Mm -hmm. So you might not want to do that when you do a drip cake. If you want a longer drip, you let it stay there for longer. I can't see what it looks like, guys, because I don't want to stop. Can you tell me? It's dripping. It's dripping? Yeah. True, you can do that. Um, What's the Drea, question? Uh, I think she was saying you can, yeah, you can use the flow coat, but a lot of people don't recommend the flow coat. Like if you use a gel, mm -hmm. you have to add flow coat to it, but it's in my opinion, it's better to just get the um, candy. Low coat, it tastes disgusting. It will change the flavor. Who's talking to y'all? Don't <laughs> use low coat, okay? Yes. Even if you use Paramount crystals, you can even use vegetable oil with your gel color in your chocolate, but it is much easier to use oil-based candy color in your chocolate. Trust me. <laughs> low coat tastes disgusting. And it also, you have to use five drops to every drop of coloring that you add. This is what it looks like. So I have some, I used it once, and you see how much is still left. So it might be going in the trash pretty soon because it's better to just get the oil. What, what I'm using, around. I'm just using... Some people like to make ganache. You can do ganache, but I'm just using chocolate. So when you use just pure chocolate, you want to hurry up before it gets hard and stiffens. Because if you keep dripping over hard, stiffened chocolate, you're going to get lumps. So you want to keep going as fast as you can with your melted chocolate. And see, if you keep running it on one part, it'll keep running down if you want long ones. If you want short ones, you just go fast pat and passing it. But I want a long one here. See, look at that. I love that. Long like one the there. Ones. Yeah. See, this way you can control your drip. This is controlling your drip. Some people just spread it over, their ganache over it, and let it fall where it is, which is fine. But if you're looking for a controlled drip and where you want it longer, or even if you want to put a design in it, you can do that too. Um, you just have to go with the pattern of your hand. So I'll do like long drip, short drip, long drip, short drip. A long drip is more of a squeeze. I want this cake to be like super drippy, is it best to chill the cake before you drip? You can if you want to. It, does, it doesn't make a difference. Um, but just FYI, if you use the chocolate and on the chilled cake, it'll freeze faster. So you might want to think about that too. So ganache, yeah, it doesn't matter because it'll take a while for that to freeze up. And then now I'm just going to pour, I need a spatula. I'm going to pour the rest of this chocolate for the center part and hopefully I have enough. Pretty. You just want to smooth it nice and evenly. Ooh, Marissa says. That's pretty. It's going to be so pretty, y'all. Beautiful, Lakeisha the Baker says. Thank you. <laughs> all right. So now you got your drips, right? Let me move all this out the way. How tall, or how does the cake slice with almond bark? It, no, it's like, it's, it's good. It's just like, it's just like um, using Wilton um, chocolate melts. It slices nice and even. It's, yeah, it's nice and soft. Someone said, it seems like it's gonna be really sweet. Well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, that's candy, it's a candy land drip cake. All right, so what you want to do for your cake is, um, let me grab a different, yeah. I'm not sure who she's talking about. <laughs> I'm not sure if she was talking to us, so I was ignoring I'm Sorry, Drea. Oh, what's Drea what saying? Say? She's like, she didn't even answer my question. Oh, <laughs> Drea. <laughs> what's your question, Drea? May, may I answer it like this? 
I thought that was a side com conversation going on, so I was like, okay. All right, so sometimes candy comes prepackaged, and you're going to want to unpackage it, obviously. And sometimes it, the stick itself is a package. So I'm just wiping down the stick because this is what I'm sticking in the cake. Because it's just like a dowel. You're sticking this in the cake. Some of them are plastic like the cake, um, or paper like the cake pop ones. And you just stick them in. So I'm cleaning off the sticks and stuff. So now, hold up the lily or the lollipop as a lollipop kiss. So this is, I got from Party City. Okay. Did everybody get the screenshots? <laughs> All right. So um, what I'm going to do is, hey, can somebody put some Those icing in a pipe in there for me? Dresses. Thanks, What, Jaya. in the one that... Yeah, it's right here. Um, I'm going to both colors. Mix it in. Okay. All right. So what I'm doing Sorry. is I'm going to take some um, Pop Rocks and colors and stuff like that, and I'm going to mix them all together in this little thing, this little cup. Mixing up different colors. You want them like side to side? No, it doesn't matter. No, yeah, just mix them. Side to side, not mix side to side. Now this is supposed to be a fun cake. Come You're to supposed Atlanta. Yeah. Jaya says she wants to come. Welcome come on, girl. Is that stuff for you, girl. This is a fun cake. Sorry. Don't. This shouldn't be stressful. This is the fun part. You can put whatever you want on this cake. If it's for a customer, stick with the colors, obviously, that they want. I'm using an assorted amount of sugar, um, crystals, and um, glitter, and stuff like that. <laughs> Mixing it up. This is Pop Rocks I started out with. We all have children, Drea. <laughs> Go on down yeah. here. Well, she said she got babies? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I guess if she can't come because she got children. Bring yeah. your babies. <laughs> so, I'm yeah, probably going to make a mess. The kitchen sink a sprinkle, so I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> I'm probably gonna make a mess, but now I'm gonna put it on around here. Oh, you take care of everyone. Do you teach classes? Yes, I teach classes. Go to my website. It's right there. That's my website. Bam, Vanna, okay. We got our very own Vanna. We're trying to hire her for all of our skills nights. Right. All right, everybody got that? about to be like, listen, I got All right, and, um, uh, Curly Duchess, tell us about your uh, upcoming classes. I do have some cake pop classes in the works. So, guys, just keep tuned for those. Once I get them all nice and finished and finalized, I'm going to be announcing some giveaways because I'm going to give away two slots in the class that I'm going to host. It's going to be virtual because, um, like Jaria says, I have babies. <laughs> what, do, who, what does who offer? Amazing um, glazing. So I offer sculpting classes. I offer cake classes, cake decorating yeah. classes. Um, Unique, uh, my uh, Curly, Curly Duchess, Duchess, she offers, offers cake pops. Yep. Cake pops um, and then dessert towers. Yeah, and, and she also does cakes also. I, and stir bake decorate, she does meringues and macaroons. Periscope, um, as soon as this scope is over with, so you guys didn't know who to follow. But there was no drip there, so I'm putting a drip. Okay, so you see how I put. Do you look, have pri do you offer private sculpting classes? Yes, we do. I do have private sculpting classes. We all we all do. Um, so yes, to answer your question, I don't know why I always answer questions with like this long answer. Just <laughs> just yes. <laughs> um, so I'm using my mixture of everything right, that I could put in a bowl. Sprinkles that still yeah, thing. and put it around on the cake. This is gorgeous. Nice. So creative. Uh, pop. Uh, what is this? Pop rocks in there. Oh my God, I need You're gonna classes want to show the top. ASAP to learn. Show up here? I'm just starting off. Well, tune in to us. Sorry. Tune in um, with us. What am I trying to say, y'all? Um, follow <laughs> us for Skills Nights. Skills Nights will happen twice a month. Um, what I'm doing now is I'm just adding like a little bit of glue to add the rest of the things that I want to put on here. All, just on the sides. I'm going to do like a half moon. Okay. Right? Because now my chocolate is stiffened. You see that? So I can't stick anything on there. Yeah. We'll put up everybody's Instagram, Facebook, you know, all of our information. And mm -hmm. uh, we all do something a little bit different. So um, you, you'll learn a lot from all of us. So we're, we, sh we share pretty much everything. And, um, you know, we're willing to help. So you know, that's what we do. <laughs> all right so what i'm doing now is now i'm just being like an artist just you know like 
care to be free it doesn't matter just you know go with the flow let's see how this falls out perfect thank you shout out to my girl unique for doing this for me um no i'm not gonna do this part but i'm still care to be free artsy stuff right um all right so i'm gonna stick it on my stuff but i want to pick the front thank you we are all so sweet so sweet la, 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 la. Is it underscore you, yes, okay, what was that about? Okay. Yes, IG is yes, underscore ma'am, oh, okay. underscore sweets. All right, so now I picked the front, which is over here on my side, but. Go in. There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, I, oh, Marissa was, well, <laughs> yeah, Moreno Valley. I was stationed at March Air Force Base. Y'all know each other? No, somebody said oh. something about Moreno Valley. I'm like, oh, that's my little spot. I love that place. Don't be so pretty. Now, now, when you stick these in the cake, you want to go as slow as possible. And I'm not going all the way down to the bottom either. Like, this one doesn't touch the bottom. I got, like, oh, sugar. This, the big one, sorry, I wasn't um, on there. The big one doesn't touch the bottom either. See that? Um, can somebody give me, uh, not you, you're holding the camera, not you, uh -huh. not you, uh -huh. no, nope, you stay here. I'm can somebody give me <laughs> the um, wire cutters, please? I thought you were going somewhere. I'm like, nope, don't go anywhere. I'm trying to get a better view, but I'm trying to stay away from the sink. I messed down here. Thank you. So you can buy these, like I said, at Party City, right? And I'm just cutting off the little ball that comes with them because we don't need that in there. So who's going to make a drip cake? Are you guys going to make a drip cake now? I hope so. Can any of us bake? Oh, I don't know what that was about. Yep, a couple people are saying yes, they're making drip cakes Woo -hoo. now. It's and somebody said they're going to try. Unique Party says they're going to try. Lots of people, yes, yes. Making one on Wednesday. Good, I want to see them. Gonna, Steph Camp is going to try. I want to see your drip cakes. Tag me in your photos. If I'm teaching you something, let me know because I don't want to teach things that you guys don't want to learn. So let me know if I'm teaching you. Tag me in your photos. Let people know that I'm that I'm doing what I hope I'm doing is giving you guys good information. Um, one person said they don't know where to start. Start where you think you're comfortable at. Um, it could be cookies, it could be chocolate, it could be cakes. I mean, it could be cupcakes. And you can start off as easy as dipping pretzels. And we can do one of those on skills night. Not everybody knows everything, so we can definitely share those things. Um, I love different kind of candy. All, these are all like dum dum candies that you know that you ate when you were a child. Drea says, um, Renoir is. His picture looks creepy. You know, I'm telling <laughs> That's you. That's my boyfriend. I know he's he's, he's nuts. <laughs> yeah, shout out to my baby daddy. <laughs> he said creepish. <laughs> yes, yeah, me. Please cut your IG disturbing mm -hmm. decor. It's uh all the way out. Okay. I didn't want to say anything. I was like, <laughs> somebody said it looks like a Willy Wonka cake and. Okay, and somebody, I gotta check my uh. Somebody grab the camera. She has to check her meringue. All right, so as you see, we got. I know, right? So we got this beautiful top, right? But we're not done. No. So pretty. Not done. What happened to my? You just have an eyeball. Right. Justice's eyes are above. Sweet Justice setting up her grass. It's touching my soul in the wrong. <laughs> Wait, who's saying that? Oh God! Listen, Henry, I just claimed you on this scope. Don't embarrass me. You can use frosting. You don't have to, but you can use frosting to top it off. And sometimes I like to use it to cover up any holes or accidental holes. I mean, or sometimes you want the variation of heights, right? So I got different type of heights going on here. Dang. Everything this will does, be on catch too, right? This will be on catch. Follow me on or go look on my catch. I don't even know if you can follow people on catch. Um, you could just view it, I think. No idea. I'm not sure. Alright, let me look at the front of it to see if I need something. I do need something. 
Mm-hmm. All right, so I'm also going to use this as glue, right? So I'm going to put a couple just random spot. If it just stays off, random spots in around. Catch is a site. It's called Catch because it catches your periscopes and it saves them there. So it's a website that you can go to and you can rewatch it anytime. Because as we know, Periscope only keeps your scope for 24 hours. What tip is that? 1M. A 1M Wilton tip. You guys would think I would know anything about the chocolate I'm using. I don't know anything. So I'm using the chocolate coins that I you know, get. I know, right? Look at me. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the chocolate coins um, that you can get at a Party City also. Everything's in the candy section of Party City. Color coded for you. No, I don't like that color. Let me get my big bowls out of here. <laughs> what am I missing? Meringue. Meringue and cake balls. All right, so now I'm going to put some cake balls. These beautiful cake balls by Curly Dutch's My Cupcake Parlor. Mm. All we did were take them, we just took them from the stick that we had earlier. Yeah, we just took them right off the stick that she put them on. She says, I hope you're selling this cake. That's a lot of stuff you bought. <laughs> Drea says, Satan's testicles. Drea, go back and wash my stuff. <laughs> and they will not be Satan's testicles no more. And then we got some meringues from uh, Stir Bake Decorate that I'm using. That she just taught us and all how to use. supposed to eat this? Yes, you yes. can eat this. Eat it. The kids will go crazy. Yes. And then you yes. have to put them in the backyard for three hours. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have to go on Instagram and look at some of these drip cakes. They are very decorated. All kinds of stuff. No, you don't got to go on Instagram. You go, on, you go right here. Yes. Right, right here. There. Don't be redirecting them to some. I'm just Right saying. here. All this hard work I put in. There's a lot of different kinds. I'm just saying. No, mine. <laughs> All right, so I'm just using different, those are kind of big, different meringue sizes. Again, you want different height. You don't want everything to be the same height. And this is a Candyland drip cake, okay? The point is it has to have candy on it, right? Do you guys think I put too much? No. I feel like I need more. Gosh, <laughs> there's a lot going on this cake. Yes. Well, the good thing is that all the candy you can pick off and just slice mm -hmm. it down and just eat the cake and enjoy it. Take the candy home as favorites, have a snack for later on. The cake is not for anyone. It's just for you guys. She's just teaching you guys a technique. So now it's up to you to be creative and come up with your own versions of the drip yep, cake. Somebody said, add more. Yeah, the kids will love add it. Add more, yes, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um... I got these balls. I like a little Just for you, lucky ball. A little gold and everything. If you like what we're teaching, share with your followers. Tell people about it. I got real serious. Like, <laughs> if you like what we're doing, oh, donate that. a dollar a day. No. <laughs> <laughs> share with your followers. Let people know that we're here just to have a good time and teach you guys um, basic skills, um, professional skills. Um, what's another word for professional? Like, a step up. Like, if you want to step up in your cake decorating, this is where it's... This is where it's at. Skills. skills night, twice a month. We'll announce it in our Facebook groups. We'll announce it on Instagram all the time. So it's an expensive cake. It's custom. Yeah, this is a custom cake. Like this isn't like a sixty dollar cake. Don't y'all be charging no. See, it was twenty dollars alone for the candy. Okay. So no, this ain't no sixty dollar cake. This is and a how custom much piece. Would you charge for this cake? How much would I charge for this cake? This cake would feed. I'd go based off what it would feed first, and then add on. Um, the cake it's uh, add on the decorations so my cakes start at um around 130 and then i would up from there so 130 plus the 20 dollars um candy plus the meringues plus the cake pops that were made so you're looking about a 200 dollars cake here i know it sounds crazy but let me tell you this feeds at least 50 people this is a double barrel it'll feed at least 50 people so remember that she used the uh, four four box mixes. Yeah, I use four box cake. mixes. One box mix it's will make eight it eight inch. inch round. Yeah, it's an eight inch. I'm putting gold uh, dragees on there. I love the colors. Yes, yes. Right. and if you if you if we if we were quiet women, but we're not. 
you would hear the pop rocks popping on this Is thing. Is that what that was? Yeah, it, everything's popping it. on it. <laughs> and that makes it fun for kids. And it'll make mm -hmm. it fun for adults, too. Especially when they think it's just sugar and then mm -hmm. it's that added little element yeah. surprise. Let's see. Where I think... Um, <laughs> She's like, I don't know. Someone just told me to hold it. I so, see a trip to Michael's in my future. Yes. Andrea yeah. says that she hears the pop rock. You hear him? Oh, perfect. All right. So, um... So yeah, so let's go over this again. Eight inch cakes, it was four, five layers high. It was four layers high, eight mm -hmm. inch cakes, two inches high each, all candy. No, I'm not even gonna use that. Four candy. boxes of cake mix. Four boxes of cake mix. Uh, mix um, Wilton buttercream if you want, want Wilton buttercream. She's gonna post a fish, finished cake on IG and yes. Facebook. Yes, screenshot this. <laughs> Her Facebook name. <laughs> well, just go to Love Sweets, that's the Facebook group, and you'll find her. Are people taking pictures? Someone take a picture. I don't want to be posing look yes, like a moron. Okay. Pictures. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, nine, fifteen. <laughs> Remember, you guys were here first. Let them get a top view. Show them the top view. Love sweets. Yep. L U V S and then Ready. sweets. So you got a variety oh, of different treats on top. You got cake balls. You got meringue. You have rock candy, pop rocks, mm. chocolate. Your it's just whatever your imagination can right. dream of. I mean, so you can the, just make even it fun. the candy could be favors. Mm hmm Awesome cake. All right, so I'm gonna tag you. Yes. Oh, one thanks. Mix, yes, one mix each in each pan. Okay, so um, follow us on our social media. There's our social media right here. So we're getting the cake and your boobs. Oh, uh -huh. okay. Who said that? <laughs> my Dream unique. Up. Oh, my unique sweet. So, this is me. I'm Jelena from Yes Ma'am. It's IG Yes underscore Ma'am Sweets. My Perry is Yes Ma'am Sweets. Um, we had to get off of mine because it wasn't working earlier. And my website is uh, www.yesma'am.us. If you want to know anything about my classes or contact me, go go to any one of these um, things and you can get it. Nice. We're trying to take Yay! No, oh, they're taking sorry. pictures. Sorry. Uh, this is Unique. She does um, cupcakes, cakes. Cake pop. She specializes in a lot of different things. Um, her IG is My Cupcake Parlor. Her Perry is Curly Duchess, and her web is MyCupcakeParlor.com. And then we have Deandra, who was our were you our first scoper? No, our second scoper. Um, Skills Night. Her IG is Stir Bake Decorate, and her Perry is Stir Bake Decor, decor. and the number eight. Yep. How clever! Decor eight. Isn't that clever? <laughs> and then we have Lala. Look at Lala. Hey, Lala. Got a website, but. Not How well does the drink Damn. part cut? Would it crack? Use a special knife or technique to cut? No, uh, just use a regular knife. Oh, yeah, hot knife. Uh, yeah, uh, you can use a hot knife or you can just use Kamisha, ice. Or everybody regular knife. knows your info. Okay. Who, who's that? Kamisha? <laughs> yes. Oh. Where is her info? Everybody knows your info. Uh, Lala is Ula La Confection. That's how you have to say it. And then her Perry is Lala215. Okay? She'll be on next skills night. Kamisha, Kamisha, say something. She's a, she'll be on next skills night too, from Sweet Justice. Um, we'll have uh, Janelle from Never Desserts you on. We'll have a bunch of different people. So look out for our skills night. Yeah, we're gonna try to mix it up so you don't see just the same people, you know, demonstrating different things. But we'll try to mix it up for different people, and um, we're gonna also just do different. Sorry, we're gonna try to do different recipes, different skills. So if you guys, um, when you go on Love Sweets, just put in a um, suggestion. Maybe we'll try to do it for you. So thanks, guys. I'm just putting more crap on this. <laughs> Because I, I love the colors. I'm going to be blue. Of bees everywhere. <laughs> you are so welcome. We're happy that you all enjoy it. Show poster info again. Skilled Night is Bob. I am Yay. so happy. It's me. Whoop, whoop. Okay. Follow us, guys. We have so much information we Thank want to share with you guys. Thanks. We have so much classes. Thank you guys so much for following us. Watch, for you guys watching the replay, thanks. And for all the people, it's Skills Night is for from the beginner all the way to the advanced. advanced. So you don't for. have to just be, you know, already doing this. If you're just new and starting out, follow us. You'll we'll show you some basic stuff all the way to I can't even believe I can do Dre this. Dre needs so. help with sharp edges and covering and planning. We got you, boo. We got you. <laughs> All right, guys, have a good night, and we will catch you on the next one. Bye! Bye! Bye. Bye. Meet up in the future. <laughs> Ooh.